Hey guys, it's me, OP Games. Back for episode 12 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap. Uh, I do have, uh, pneumonia. I just, uh... I just went to the doctor today, and... Yeah, I'm sick. But, uh... All that means for you guys is... I'm making more, um... More... Episodes in a day now because I'm not leaving the house. I got full health. Let's take on this boss. Hopefully, get the element and be on our way. Hopefully, this boss isn't too difficult. I mean, it's the third dungeon boss. It might be a little bit difficult, but that looks like you're gonna need some arrows. Especially because they filled you up on arrows in the room before. Rude! Don't try to squash me with your hand. Okay, can I get? Thank you. Get out of the way. He was gonna hurt me, and he hurt me anyway. Ooh, yay! More. Okay, so I guess you won't run out of arrows in this fight because you'll need them a lot, apparently. I don't know how long this fight's gonna be. I'm assuming pretty long. Um, nothing else to do, except, uh, I guess there's a tiny little minish portal inside, or, uh, uh, a little room in the mouth of this guy. Keep swinging at the eyeball until this guy takes you out. Then I guess the battle kind of restarts, but he took one damage. <laughs> okay, it's phase two, I guess. It's already harder to... Okay. It's harder to... Okay, that was just me messing up, but... It is harder to... Get the arrows... <sighs> where they're supposed to go. Thank you for more arrows. These bugs are coming out now. Oh, they stick to you. Okay. I'll make you go slower. So, I'm gonna kill every bug I see. That's... The plan. Now, I'm assuming the hands only say... Oh, ooh, I did not think that that would hit. Uh, the, I'm assuming the hands only stay decommissioned for a little while. And that, uh, that if I wait too long before decommissioning the other hand... Oh, moments. Uh, then... Uh, okay, there it is. Um, that they would get back up. So yeah, my coughing and stuff from clearing my throat from earlier is definitely because of the fluid in my lungs. Sorry guys, but uh, if you guys can deal with that, I am definitely still making videos, making more, still uploading daily, until this game is done at least. <clears throat> I did not- okay, bugs. Did not know there was going to be a giant thing, electric tail thing there. Full, uh, full, um, what do you call them, arrows? I wonder how many times we have to do this before it's done. There's three here. Alright, and, oh, there's six, so we'll have to do this six times. Okay. And we're halfway... Oh! We're done! I think. Yeah, he's done. Element now, please. Oh, stairs. You got a heart container! Your life energy is increased and replenished. I know. That's what a heart container does. We're right outside. Don't know. Uh, there's no element there. Let's read this stone tablet. We are the tribe of the winds. Long have we lived with the winds. We have mastered them. Now we join them. Together with the great winds at our backs, we head for the skies. Those who come seeking our power must play the notes Zepha teaches. Who the hell is Zepha? May they lead you onward to the power that you seek. Oh, that's Zepha, probably. You got the Ocarina of Time! I mean, wind. Sorry. 
north, south, east, and west, they're just all a breath away. I do believe this is where the Tribe of the Winds once lived. Hmm, so they've left for the heavens, and taken their element with them. It looks like the wind element is beyond our reach for the time being. We have no choice but to press on. Let's get out of here. Even if we did have the element, we still have to press on. The element was not here, but at least we now have a clue to its whereabouts. You must use the Ocarina of Wind to open a new path. Well, there's no point in standing around. Go get that last element. Um, that's not the last element. I'm pretty sure we only have... Yep, we only have two right now. And it looks like there's four here. And where's the... Where, where is the third element? In Lake Hylia. Of course, the Water Temple. Let's go to Lake Hylia, I guess. Now we can travel between all the wind crests that we've activated, which is amazing. Aha! So that mysterious mark we've been seeing is a wind crest. If you play the Ocarina of Wind, Zephyr comes to pick you up and fly you away. That means we can have Zephyr carry us to any other wind crest we've seen. Are you following me, MioP? Don't hurt your brain thinking about it. Just give it a try, and you'll see what I'm talking about. How did we get to this wind crest earlier? This is like a secluded area that you can't get to any other way. How the heck did I get to this wind crest earlier? Oh, how a visitor, how rare. But you have found me the wisest of the wisest of the wise. You what? You want to enter the temple you can see in the lake? They call that place the Temple of Droplets. Ooh, sounds menacing. I have heard rumors that one Minish actually did find a way in long ago. That Minish is Elder Library, and he is in semi-retirement in the town library. Huh, how fitting. The library should be opening soon. Perhaps you can go find him. Alright, uh, let's resize and I guess go to the library, which is in Hyrule Town, so... Hopefully we have... Yes, we did. We have traveled to... We, we've uh, destroyed the, the stone that unlocks the wind crest in Hyrule Town, so we can go to the library now, because it's open. Uh, which, which one do I want to talk to first? Okay. Welcome to the library! Hey, aren't you Smith's grandson, MLP? Enjoy your browsing! Oh, thank you. I'm in charge of checking out books, so it's not my problem. But still, I feel really bad for the girl over there in charge of returns. Somebody has an overdue book! Or somebody's giving them a really hard time and do doesn't want to pay for their overdue book. Let's uh, turn into a Minish. Back into this Minish hole in the library. Not back, but back into the library, into this Minish hole. Only thing we can do right now is talk to this Pecori here. Hey, 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 this is no good, no good at all. The humans have checked some books out of the library. Thanks to them, none of us can get back to Elder Library. How will he get by all alone? I'm so worried. I'm sure the librarian knows something about where those books went. I wish I were big. Why, I'd walk right up and ask her where those books went. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Elder Library can make it on his own. He went to the Temple of Droplets and survived, so... Yeah. That's all I'm gonna say. Um... This part of the game... was too hard for me... at... Uh, to do by myself. So I do have some hints about where to go. Sorry, it's not blind anymore. Welcome to the library! Say, aren't you Smith's grandson, me, LP? Hmm? The book's missing from the bookshelf on the second floor? Yes, they've been checked out for quite a while. They're very overdue. Yep, I called it. Take a Hyrulean bestiary, for example. Been gone for ages. Checked out by a girl with a cat. She said she had a new cat at her house. Wanted to learn more about it, she did. That's a weird way of talking, but whatever. Let's go to this, uh, girl with... The cat's house. Where is it? It's, uh... There's two parts of Hyrule Town, the north and the south. And... Her house should be in the south. So, uh... It's right over there. It's right over there. Right over there! Okay. 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 Get in. It's the cat! But not the girl. 
Hmm, say, look at that, Mio P. Oh, the book. There's a book up on top of the bookcase. But how are we going to get it? We can't reach it, and we have no ladder. And I don't think just shaking the bookcase will make it fall either. Why don't we try? This presents an, this presents an interesting... I was, I'm guessing he's, he said predicament, wouldn't you say? But, dear mom, I'll be next door if you need me. Next door? You mean the one adjoining your house? Okay. There she is! Try to use the cane Apache on her. Huh? A book from the library? I heard the investigary. Is that the one? Yeah, I checked that out a while ago. You came all this way to get it? Wow, you're one dedicated librarian. I'm not a librarian. But, I don't know how to tell you this, but it's back at my house. Would you mind going there to get it? I just can't leave right now, see? Yeah, I'm with my boyfriend. Um, oh, I, I'm so sorry to tell you this, but it's all the way back in my house. The one adjoining this one. Um... Uh, I was told- I was- I was told I need some water. You put water in your bottle, sprinkle that on different things. Um... Only problem with that is I had to get rid of my fairy, which didn't even help me at all. Let's, uh, do that, I guess. That didn't do anything. Let's, uh, turn into a cory sized kid, a uh, minish sized kid, and, uh, get into this house. Which we looks like we can now get the book. Whoa! Did you see that cat looking at me? I know it wants a piece of me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it doesn't. Wah! That really startled me. Everything's scary when you're small. Yeah. Um. Okay, so we can push the book off the shelf. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go back. Oh! The cat actually does want a piece of him. Okay. Or a piece of me. I'm, I'm the minish sized kid in the that Ezlo was just on. Okay, what does what does the boyfriend say? They say the king's been weird lately, but that doesn't really have anything to do with our love. Okay, she says the same thing. I love how he talks about love and she talks about this book. All right, um, <laughs> let's get the book. You got a library book called a Hyrulean Bestiary or Bestiary. I don't really know how to say it. I, I was calling it bestiary, but then I was told before this video that it was bestiary, so I'm gonna call it bestiary from now on. <sighs> Pick up some water. Just in case we need it later. Hey, look at that! Our long lost copy of a Hyrulean bestiary. MLP, are you returning this book? Thank you so much! I can't begin to describe how much I'm looking forward to putting this back. You know, but leave it on the shelf right there. The next overdue book is... let's see... Ah, yes, of course. Legend of the Picori. It's been out forever. It was checked out by a somewhat absent-minded scholar, I believe. How does she remember these things? If they're long overdue... How does she remember the... who took them out? Okay, whatever. Um, the absent minded scholar, you need the, the house he's in, you need to become tiny first. Uh, at first, I didn't think you could go over this bridge as a minish sized kid, but apparently, you can. His house is to the. Whoa! Postman, how'd you jump over that? I want to do that as a normal-sized person. Let's talk to this dog. He was in our way. Oh, sorry. Am I in your way? I just wanted a little attention. Anyway, it was nice of you to say hi. Sorry for the trouble. I'll move now. Thank you. Uh, are you gonna move? No? He's not gonna move, guys. Oh, he moved. As soon as I went away. Guess he still wants attention. Every time you move away. Postman, what are you doing? Let's go back in here. Oh. Okay. This, um, <clears throat> portal has not been, or the pot has not been flipped yet. <sighs> Which means we have to go all the way back to the other side of the, uh, 
town, the east side of town, which is just right over this bridge. Not that hard, but still, to uh, get the Minish Portal and be activated as a normal kid again, as a human. But, uh, now that the dog's out of the way, we can go back to the, um, that, that house that the dog was guarding. First, I'm gonna flip this over for future endeavors. Um, the way to get to his house from, as a human, is by going to the northern part and then going down. I had to figure that out for myself. Really, dog? Oh! Does he only let you pass when you're a minish? Like, can you, can you leave? Oh, okay, he left. He left, okay. He's, he's out of the way. Get into the house we go. No, not, not the King Apache. What? Huh? A book? From the library? Ah, yes, of course. I knew this day would come. Please, come in. Okay, fine. I was gonna do that anyway. I am a researcher of Pecori legend and lore. My name is Dr. Left. How original. You're here about that book, Legend of the Pecori, aren't you? Well, I hate to say this, but I haven't seen it in several days. Perhaps a mischievous little mouse has taken it. Well, I'm sure it's in this house somewhere. I just don't know where. But I'm very busy right now. <laughs> what is he busy doing? So why don't you look for it yourself? Okay, uh... Okay, first we want to use the water on this fireplace. Second, there are multiple minish holes in this house. So I guess we're gonna have to come back later. Third! I guess we have to become a minish. Size kid. Hello, Melon. How you doing? No, I don't want to talk to you. Just an empty bottle if I find a new kind of... What? What did he just say? What kind of bite? A pico... Picola bite? I don't, I don't even know. Okay, but I forgot where... I, I forget where the, um... That house that I just flipped the... Uh... The pot over was, so... I'll use this one, or that one, that I just did, to do what I have to do. Let's try to... I did not mean to roll into the water. Back over to this guy's house. Postman, can you stop it? Okay, uh, into the... this... Let's go into here... Talk to this guy. Hey, do you know the clues that reveal the location of the treasure? Across the bridge that spans the rapid flow, through the land of the fearsome beast, until you reach the Misty Falls. The treasure sleeps on the other side of the secret entrance there. They say it's a magical tool that allows even little people to push big things. According to the legend, you're supposed to start from this house. Oh, this, this house right here. Well, nice. Go in the fireplace, just like you did with the others. I'm gonna talk to... Whoever's in here, I really like this house. This is the best place in this whole human town. I want to stay here forever. Okay, uh, I actually went over the time a little bit. I'm going to save and quit now. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for future videos. We see you guys next time. I love you all. Bye.